Hello there. Thank you so much for joining us here on CBS News Baltimore. Today is a WJZ alert day. We are looking at the possibility for strong to severe storms starting late this afternoon. It's one of those days where it can be very deceiving, though, because we're actually going to end up with a nice dose of sunshine for a good chunk of the day. The heat and humidity, though, really in action. Flood watch already issued, so it goes into effect at 4 o'clock this afternoon. Stays in effect through midnight. We're looking at heavy thunderstorms that could produce rain rates of one to two inches an hour. That is certainly rain that's heavy enough to trigger flash flooding. So you can see uh, Baltimore City, Baltimore County included, Howard County, Anne Arundel County, Montgomery, Prince George's County, on through DC. So please keep this in mind. The severe threat for today is a slight risk. Remember, that's a two out of five on the scale. Five being the highest, one being the lowest. The main threats, damaging winds, isolated tornadoes, and even hail. So this is something that we are keeping a very close eye on. And of course, we will let you know if and when watches or warnings are issued for severe storms. Your out the door numbers, we are in the mid to upper 60s into the low 70s. There's the cold front. So right now you'll notice it's not a big storm producer. That will change though because by the time it moves through Maryland, we are looking at temperatures in the low 90s with heat index values in the upper 90s. So when that warm moist air combines with that cold air, when those two crash, that's the perfect setup to see these damaging winds and isolated tornadoes. Today that 92, but plan for it to feel well into the mid to maybe even the upper 90s. Tonight, we're going to be back down into the upper 60s and low 70s. Let's time out these storms. So remember, we stay quiet for a good chunk of the day. There we are, 1 o'clock this afternoon. We're still looking at a lot of sunshine. That changes, though, pretty quickly. So any time after lunchtime, there's the possibility for these strong to severe storms. And yeah, these are some pretty rough looking cells here, according to the future cast. Remember when we see the purple, that indicates the hail. When we see those reds, those oranges indicating very heavy downpours. And we're not done with these storms until late tonight, even into very early tomorrow morning in those pre dawn hours. Our seven day forecast for you. So you can see that tomorrow we do have some improvements, more of a mix of sun and clouds. Of course, we'll talk more about what you can expect coming up in just a bit.